everybody welcome back to pink crafty world today i have a, a small uh shopping haul and it's uh from a thrift store and also i have my package here that i received from the happy crafter shop lisa um she has a a youtube channel uh she's the happy crafter here in youtube and she also have an online store and i placed an order with her, with her and i wanted to share with you guys uh what i did get um it says a snap share and tag happy crafter shop uh, thank you for supporting my small business and uh, everything came in this cute box and here is my box with the goodies that i did order so she sent me a a uh, free gift and it's so cute because it's this um tiny uh umbrellas i believe they are they look like umbrellas umbrellas or or flowers i'm not sure they can be um like a flower like a they can be like tiny flowers also because they have the stem like towards the side so it can be some type of like uh flowers uh, dand dandelion or something like that super cute love it anyway they're super cute um so thank you so much for that lisa so here's our hair handles and yeah i ordered from her this uh clay mix and it's uh those flowers with the uh white clay bits so beautiful and i think um yeah i ordered one that is the mix and then i ordered one that is just the flowers so beautiful and I ordered this. I have some of these, but I'm running very low. And I like this diamond shape on this uh, type of sequin um, mix. It's so pretty. So I got that. And I also ordered in the white uh, iridescent. It's so beautiful and so sparkly. Love, love that color. Just beautiful. And I also ordered um, these butterflies in the pink iridescent. Just so, so pretty um, to have it for some of my collections. So, yeah, very, very cute. Um, also, I ordered these Velcro dots from her shop. These are in black. So grab those i grab these uh cabochon pieces and these are bows and i like the material of these bows um they are like so soft and nice to the touch and different colors so pretty these bows i ordered these um charms bow charms they are super cute also and they are in blue and pink and they're animal um bows so so pretty love the colors on them um also uh did order these these are so cute also i love the shape on these because it's like this flourish um type of charm it's so pretty and uh, they are like the flower with the flourish ribbon or it looks like a flourish piece and you can hang them from here it has a part where you can loop them and have orange uh, teal hot pink and purple and red different colors so nice and then i ordered these flat back pieces and they are so cute 
on is these bunnies here. Oh my God, I love these. Look how cute. They are pretty big, like nice size with the yellow tulip. I love those. So, so cute. Super excited about these and it's uh, seven of them. So great, great uh, to have in my stash for now for Easter projects. I hope that I get to do some with uh, all these wonderful goodies from the Happy Crafter shop. Um, okay, another item that I want to share now it's what I did get at the thrift store. I have a local thrift store. So it's been like years that I didn't go there. And we finally stopped there after maybe like five years. And the owners, they remodel everything. It looks so gorgeous. And it's like more than a thrift store. It's like an antique store. Let me correct that. And they, they have gorgeous stuff there i did enjoy going in there um and the first item that i did get was these i couldn't resist to get these they are so beautiful and let me share with you guys this i did get these pieces these vintage pieces here um so cute and this was only $3, but I couldn't receive. They're like very thick, thick shipboard. You guys can see the layers. So I go ahead and grab it for $3. I grabbed that one. Then I get this one. It was also $3. So cute. Um, also, I have this one with the pumpkin. And... Oh my God, look at her. She's so cute. It's a little bit damaged here, but you know what? I think I'm gonna go over with a little bit of white paint and paint it, you know, so it that is not be so noticeable. But you know, at the end for $3, it's just, it's okay. And this one, this one is my favorite one. She is so stinking cute. And I think I'm gonna display them somewhere, some somehow here in my craft room. I'm gonna try to find a way to display them. Uh, and it was also three dollars for this. Just super cute. I like vintage stuff like that. So I did grab those. Um, the name of the place is um, Fat Sally's Warehouse. Uh, that's you know the name and they are the owners um they are great people there and i actually you know did enjoy stopping there and see how they he did you know uh remodel everything and it's downstairs and upstairs and it's a huge long building full with a lot of um antique stuff very very nice so I did enjoy uh, the visit to Fat Sally's Warehouse. So here is uh, the information of, of Fat Sally's Warehouse. It's in Asheville, Ohio. So great, great place. Um, Another item that I did get there, it was a bunch of doilies. I couldn't resist. I have doilies, but I did get them. It was $2 a piece, but look how beautiful are these doilies. I don't know. I did think about, you know, strawberries and the, this shape made me think of a strawberry. And, um, you know, it's, I think it's so pretty. Um, this one. Look how beautiful it is. I have a bunch of doilies. Um, then it's this one in the mint green. Look how beautiful. 
Then it's this one here. And they are all like two or three dollars, no more than that. So here is this other one. Then it's this one is I get two of the same. Because I found these ones are they are so cute that I just like oh my god I have to have those. Then this yellow one so beautiful i did get another one of the peach color i think i did get like two or three of these see they are similar they're not the same but you know the colors are very similar um here it's another one of the peach so you guys can see they are you know different stitches which it makes it amazing right just so so beautiful love that so here is another one of the red ones this one is the same of these so pretty um then i did did get this lavender one and then this And then this one here in yellow. And this one. There are two tones of yellow. The same design, but two different tones of yellow. So did like those. I grabbed those. And um, another piece that I did found that I did fall in love with is this cute the ones are with being with me for a very long time you guys know that um i have a love for uh milk glass and i have a collection of milk glass um and i can't resist what i found milk glass so i found this cute hobnail milk glass basket and look how beautiful it is it's just stunning it was 30 dollars but i was you know happy that i did pay the 30 dollars um i don't regret it at all i think it's so gorgeous and so beautiful um just love this piece it's so pretty so um easter vibe and so my color with the pink and the iridescent is just very very beautiful so i gladly did pay the 30 dollars um that they was asking for so yeah so so pretty sorry that you know i can't show it any better than that because you know it's kind of big but and then the last item that I wanted to show, um, I'm gonna have to include a a clip here because it's actually a, a big piece, not that big, but it's kind of big. So I'm gonna move it over here. I'm gonna move my camera and then I'm gonna share it with you guys. Okay, guys, this here it's what I'm talking about. This is the other piece that I did get at the antique store. Um, as you guys can see, it's like a mini cabinet type thing. And it's so cute. Um, I couldn't leave it behind. So I go ahead and grab this. Please don't mind the mess in my table. It's a mess. Um, I'm organizing my hauls uh, that I did uh, this couple of days ago. So I still have stuff everywhere. But, you know, it's it's pretty big. You know, it's it's not big, big, but it's decent size for how big it is and um it needs to be painted you know it needs to be fixed and all that but i think it has a lot of uh character and it will bring you know another space for me to store things because inside it opens like that and it have these two shelves here and it's wood it's wood it's not you know anything fake or anything cheap um 
and they cl it closed very nicely. I probably will change these knobs here and put something more cuter. And yeah, I'm super, super excited about that. Um, I think uh, one I painted and I'm thinking to paint it and decoupage um, this and make it look very cute and go a little bit with my aesthetics here in the craft room. But one, um, I get that done. Um, I think I maybe put it over there in the shelf over there where all that mess is. Yes, um, behind my machine there uh, is a shelf there you know organize that better um right now has my cinch and other machines my my button press and all that so organize that better and put these on top of there and you know go from there um but uh sorry that i show you my mess but like i said i'm organizing i'm cleaning i'm doing different things here in my craft room because this craft room is crazy pack <laughs> and um yeah but um, i think it's it's gonna be looking very cute once i get it painted and decoupage and do everything that i'm gonna do with it um it will look very very cute so yeah and this will conclude my haul from the antique store and my online shopping um so Thank you so much, as always, for watching, for being in here with me. I hope to see you very, very soon. Uh, don't forget to thumbs up. And I will see you back soon in another whole or crafty video. Bye-bye now.